our host for today, and we're going to be playing some more Witcher 3 Wild Hunt today. With the Heart of Stone expansion, naturally, because we want to get this finished, to be honest. Because it's real good, and I want to see the ending. Um, yeah, and then we've got the... I think we're going to finish it today. I'm not certain, because naturally, I don't know how long it's how long it is. Uh, though, no, this is supposed to be the shorter of the two, so... I think we're about ten hours into the this expansion-ish. Maybe, maybe less. I don't know. It's hard to keep track. I just had to do a very quick, like, hour D&D game. But it was like half an hour D&D game because of, um... Uh, dentist appointments and things. People did want to actually just have a bit of fun. They carved through the easy round, which was uh, 12 wear rats. It's very rare to, I get to say 12 wear rats on the easy round. Uh, then they were fighting... Uh, three uh, big metallic glowing green looking necrony spider things and an iron golem and that's the second easy round okay so it should be fun and I'm really looking forward to them getting to round three and more importantly to round four because I will say I'm rather proud of round four myself so have some fun shall we enough of that oh yeah that's a point as well because of that, i wasn't able to watch my anime today so i'll check and see if it's out yet no it's not ah sad oh but that's out. okay want to watch shield hero damn it i didn't get to watch it today so i won't there will not be a shield hero comment today Although I do hear from uh, the internet telling me it's a good episode. So anyway, let's get into the game, shall we? Find rare herbs and hidden treasure underwater. I know. I don't really need to, though. But I know. If any protects the shield, try to strike him behind or with the odd sign. Yep, I know. I hate shields. So much in this game. Ooh, merchant limited. You have one card from each merchant. Yes. Which I have no idea how many more opponents I actually have. An error message just came up again. One second. I'll be back in a moment. King Cat. I'm willing to bet it's Errol. Okay. Damn, can I get back in time? No, it was just actually a minor error. So, yeah wasn't the cat for once, which makes a nice change, to be honest. <clears throat> so, what were you doing? Uh, meet Orgid's man at the Alchemy Inn. Can you imagine an inn for alchemists? Uh, I imagine most people do, because... Uh... I mean, I'm guaranteed there's an inn inside uh, Full Metal Alchemist. I need, to, I need to watch that. I seriously need to sit down just one uh, for a couple days uh, when I'm free and just watch Full Metal Alchemist. Or at least Brotherhood. Because I've heard Brotherhood's better. I'm not here to, like, comment either way. I've not watched. I've not fully watched either of them. Oh, it's just some Arrakis. Yeah, I haven't fully watched either one. Oh, I have a skill point. When did I get that? I must have gotten a shitload of XP, actually. Yeah. So you want to improve this ability. I 
again, don't know if I uh, did the correct move last time, but I didn't want to kill the lass. I remember that. I mean, I could have. It wouldn't have been a terrible idea, to be honest, but bandit camp. I don't mind fighting a bandit camp. I haven't done that for ages. I'm assuming it's this. One of his friends. Yeah, I made him shoot his friend. And this is why, guys, you don't ever fire a crossbow into melee. Well, didn't it? I don't think I've ever seen anyone use a blackjack. I got a thing. Wait. I found a higher item level item than mine? I don't know if I want it. Now mine's actually still better. It's like it's got less armor value, but it's just better in every way with the actual resistances. So no, fuck you, get. <laughs> actually, have to genuinely look at those ones now. But it's nice to know that I can potentially get some better gear. But my current chest plate is more than sufficient for everything I've been doing so far. Oh yeah. Go little buddy. Roach. That's it, Roach. So anyway, how's everybody doing today is my classic my classic line for when I'm just getting on a horse. Cause I've been having a fun time. The party in D D are being very interesting, to say the least so far. There are plans and plots in motion. For all of them, which is making uh, making me just laugh mostly, to be honest. And one of the party members is scared shitless because they've got a reticulated python in their room. It's quite a nice snake. It's like it is got intelligence to it uh, because everything in the area they currently have that's an animal has some form of intelligence to it right now. Just to where they are. They're in a very special area. And it's not the Feywild. They're in a place hilariously where magic is mostly fixed. Which I quite like the idea that it's... That where they are currently is more magically sound than anywhere else on the planet. It's also the by far the highest amount of magic. Whoa there, Roach. That was a noise. But they're 
being entertaining. Certainly. They're a hard group to keep in line as a GM. Because they try all sorts of stuff. But it's pretty fun. And I would probably wouldn't change it out. I'd rather have a group which is like really wanting to just try random shit than a group which is boring. Because they are not boring. I will 100% tell you Come that. On. They are not a boring group to say them. To say them. Also quite happy because um, I'm on a uh, DM page on Faster. Uh, Facebook now. I'm not going to say what the page's name is, but... Uh, there is a thing which is basically just a specific for GM's page, so he can discuss ideas and things. Uh, and a few people seem to like a couple of my ideas, which is huge com uh, compliments for me. Because anyone who's willing to GM... I, I, I can instantly put respect. No, maybe not myself, because I kind of half-ass it. But anyone who genuinely puts a shitload of time and effort into DMing... Um, for D and D or something, huge props to them. Oh, something's going on. Two points and be quick about it. Oh, please, good sir, a bit of courtesy. So I look up, and Bob's your uncle. He downs half the barrel in one draft. Carol, over here. Hello. Oi, wait a look. Use the look of a man who knows how to drink. Thanks. Some other time. Hey now. Don't make me beg. My treats. Oh, that's the thing. She's about to slap him. Cool trick. Of course I am. Wouldn't you be? Time's a marvelous plaything. <laughs> yeah. And a great spice to use in gingerbread. So, you were listening. Indeed, occasionally I find time manipulation irresistible. Controlling it offers so many appetizing opportunities. Like spiking the soup of unsavory individuals with appropriately ghastly. Who are you really? Who are you really? I'm actually curious. Gauntero Dim, also known. Not what I'm asking. Ah, so you'd rather know what it is I do? In brief, I give folk what they ask for. You might say, I simply grant their wishes. He's a genie. Awfully noble of you. That'd be downright noble. If you didn't always demand something in return. Law of the market. I was not the one to coin the phrase, nothing comes free. It's not wrong. I'm not human, that's clear. So what are you? A demon? That's my two, two thoughts. Do you really wish to know? Yeah, why Yes. No, Geralt. You don't. This one time I shall spare you and not grant your wish. Okay. All who have learned my true name. Met an even worse fate. Yet I still need you. Okay. Three. You actually control time, or is this just some conjurer's trick? What difference does it make? A big one. <laughs> Let us say time has always fascinated me. So I taught myself how best to use it. Why time of all things? Geralt, there are four dimensions. Length, width, height, and time. What would you have me fall in love with? Width? Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense. Okay, why are you here? So, to what do I owe the pleasure? I wanted to congratulate you. You acquitted yourself splendidly with all here. In fact, you've almost satisfied your debt. Was supposed to fulfill his three wishes. Did just that. This is where you remove the brand. Because we're even. Nearly. To fulfill the terms of the contract to the letter, you must do one more thing. Draw Olvir to the temple of Ilvani. Yeah? 
We never discussed that. Oh, but we did. As a man of the world, you should know that every contract contains a catch or two. Small print, which, nevertheless, changes the ultimate meaning of the pact. This applies to oral contracts as well. Recall that I said, and I quote, I believe, however, that all will end well, and once it does, we three shall meet and thank one another for the voyage we shared. End yeah, quote. true. Mm, yeah, I remember. Fulfill your end of the bargain, and I will remove. Seems fair. That was the last time you interrupted me while I was talking to someone. Oh! What the devil? Why is there a fly in my suit? I was waiting. I had an eye out for you. Didn't see you come in. How is it you're here? I'm quick. I'm just real quick. I'm a witcher. Superhuman quickness. Just one of my many qualities. You tossed this fly in my suit? No. Now listen carefully. <laughs> no. Tell your Ataman to come to the Temple of Rovani. It's south of here. Entrance is inside a cave. <coughs> What's the commotion? Rovani's temple. Got it? Aye. Got it. All that. Yep. Your friend. The medic. She were here. Ask that you look in on her. Thanks. Cheers, buddy. Good folk. Did you see? That milk right, guy literally you dropped dead. Over there, kiss alive. My a moment ago. Oh. Sort of fainted. He's soaked in blood. Uh, yes, I am going to talk to Shani in her house. Eternal fire for Texas. Now he's like, oh yeah, this is optional. No, it's not. Shani's awesome. I'm not gonna fuck up and forget another one. Oh, sorry, miss. Hey, Shani. Shani. Oh, Geralt. Good thing you're here. Oh, she's packing. What happened? Somebody break in? This? Uh, no. Just getting ready to move. Oh! What? When? when where to? Uh, not what I wanted to talk to you about. Or at least not only, but... I'm leaving, Geralt. The Eastern Front beckons. Oh! I'm okay. heaven bound. This departure so sudden. Never mentioned you'd be moving. Any intention to either? I didn't know I would be. Ah. Uh, found out this morning. Army. Two soldiers came to my door, said Redania needs me again. Couldn't turn them down. Just say no. Uh, perhaps I could have, but I didn't want to. Yeah, I get that. Treating the ill and wounded—it's my calling. No place I'm needed more than at the front. Nah, she's gonna do it anyway. I see. I understand. Any chance we'll see each other again? Someday, I'm sure. Anything about Olgird? So, learn anything about Olgird? Well, I abandoned the books quickly. Decided that if I was going to learn the truth, I'd need to find someone who knows it. Okay. Find anyone? Turned out I didn't need to look far. A colleague at the Academy. An assistant to Professor Permethine Shakespeare claims Olgird von Everick met with the professor multiple times. Apparently, Olgird asked the professor to do some research. The professor got so worked up doing it, he went daffy, started jealously guarding his notes, wouldn't even let his assistant look okay. at Okay. The professor, where will I find him? Here in Oxenfurt. Cloistered inside his house on Academy grounds. Mage hunters guard his door. Mage hunters? Mage hunters at the door. He under house arrest? I can't say, really. Some of the faculty think him a traitor. Say he sold out to the hunters for a hefty price. Ah, uh, that makes sense, actually. The assistant, on the other hand, insists the professor wants him there to protect them. I don't know what from. 
What's your guess? He's certainly useful to them. A specialist in black magic and the occult? Must be a trove of mm. knowledge. If he's really gone off his nutter, I wouldn't be surprised to see them using him. I need to see this professor, then. Need to talk to this professor. We'll go together. Redanian guards all over the academy. Doubt you'll get in alone. Guards have never stopped me. You know that. Mm. Wound these, and I'll have to patch them up. Yeah. Besides, we might run into a friend. Get inside free and easy. It's always good. Uh, yes, I am going to follow you. Because Shani's awesome. How much are you going to look at the thing? Uh, the character bio for? S, 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 S. Shiny, I see. So I'm assuming that's so one of our last things at the academy these days. You mean since Radovid shut it down? I mean, is it well guarded? Might be all it is. <laughs> Many of the faculty fled to the far north. The braver ones stayed, but assumed the guises of tailors and laundresses. Why? Just curious. Scholars seem to have adopted mage tactics. Are they in the same bind? To Radovid, there's little difference between the two. Jeez. He seems to tolerate you well enough. Because he needs me. For now. So the Eastern Front, and then? Depends where they send me. Wherever it is, take care of yourself. Always do. So don't worry. Aww. I like her. To be honest, most of the like genuinely nice characters in this game are actually awesome. Go. Oh, I hear snoring. Hey, it's the Holds butler. By order of King Radovid. No one's allowed inside the academy. Not even lecturers? No one means no one. See, you've become quite the stickler, Norbert. You were much kinder when I was patching you up. By the way, how's your knee? Fine. Dandy. As if no arrow ever struck it. Consider yourself a lucky man. As if I'd not decided to operate, you'd be a cripple to the end of your days. <clears throat> Bruno, eh? Maybe we ought to let her in. She's a decent lass, not like to steal nothing. Hmm. All right. Well, alone. Which will draw too much attention. I'd rather not get chite from the captain on his account. Here's what we'll do. I'll go in, then help you sneak in around the back. How? We're just discussing this in front of them. I'll figure something out. There usually aren't nearly as many guards on the riverside. Agreed. All right. Let me in. Chani's awesome. Always be friends with the doctor. If you if you have the option to make friends with the person patching up these people in this kind of game, always a good plan. How the hell do I get around there? I guess I could actually swim. Long live it. Yeah, I like that guy. Yeah, long live it fucking guys. But yeah, you never want to piss off like a medic. Because they could be, they are the one who is patching you up when you're uh, injured. Hello. Yes, I'm on fire, all you. Are you 
there? Yeah, I'm here. Grab the line. You're awesome. Where'd you get the rope? Long story. <laughs> but we've done well. Professor Shakeslock's house is at the end of this street. Witch hunters guard the door. Doubt I'll be able to sweet talk them. Been a huge help already, Shani. Thanks. It was nothing. Really. You've done the same for me. If you wish to see me again before I go, I'll be at home. Packing will take some time yet. All right. Be seeing you. Okay, so you can actually talk to her again. I'm going to. Oh, hello. Fuck you in particular. Chunters are annoying because they're actually decent at sword fighting. I can counter. Not good enough though. Yeah, I can't be asked to loot all these. Lock tight. Need another way in. You leave a window open, maybe? Of course he did. These ladders are so tiny. Oh. He's compared to Geralt. Geralt's just huge, I think. Bread. Oh dear. Hello! Housekeeping. Uh, this doesn't look like someone lives here. Silver Lamin. Don't know the sigil. Hasn't been used in ages, looks like. There's bits of door everywhere. Fire swallow. What is the same guy? Julian Alboku's lesser key. Tomes about demons, dusty as they come. So he's probably a demon then. Shattered mirror. No sign of impact. Probably not an accident. Shattered by a sound, maybe. Someone look in it and scream. Did someone? Did this guy summon a demon? In his own house? Franco? Is that you? Yes, he did. Leave the bed punt in the usual spot. And take the platter. I shan't be eating today. Professor Shakeslock. Who the blazes? How do you get it? Get out. I know nothing. Don't wish to know anything. Understand? No, no, no. Out. Okay. Not gonna hurt you. That demon sent you. I'm sure of it. What demon? What demon? Feigned ignorance. <laughs> Please, you know. Gaunter, old dim. Yep, knew he was a demon. Incarnate. 
he didn't send me, but he is why I'm here. I'm a witcher. <laughs> a mutant. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Could be. You a prisoner here? Why are there guards outside your door? You a prisoner? Protective custody. That's the phrase. Protective. Yeah. <laughs> when I cannot decide my own fate, cannot breathe without their permission. What do they want from you? You may not be aware, but I am one of the foremost experts on the occult. Living experts, that is. My mentor was the outstanding Professor Lionel Van... And you're cooperating with the witch hunters now? Cooperating? <laughs> As if I had a choice. They're ignorant. But not enough to ignore what I know about magic, witches, sorceresses, what have you. Knowledge they use for barbaric ends. But that's okay, so he's not entirely control. a bad guy. I've come to talk. Came here I, I wish to bargain. I think you might be the only man who has it. Hmm, a witcher. Then it follows I needn't fear. I'm hardly a post-conjunction creature. <laughs> what did Orgird von Everick want from you? Curse the day I first set eyes upon the man. Seems about right. He appeared at my doorstep one day, offering a sack of gold were I only to find out who Gauntero Odim is and how to get rid of him. Oh. I agree. Such matters are my speciality. And I needed the coin. I pored over countless tomes, delved into obscure incidents and analysed folk legends. I went so far as to travel to Nilfgaard, the library there. Well, oh. at last, I hit upon the mysterious entity's trail. There are records of encounters dating back thousands of years in many cultures under many names, but always as evil incarnate. In this land, we call him Gauntor Odin, at times, Master Mirror or the Man of Glass. In deciphering the ancient scrawlings, I went blind. Yet I learned a great deal. For example, that he plays with his victims thrives on pacts above all else. Seemingly harmless contracts which drive their parties to madness. Sir, let's check on the floor. What's that about? What's with the surroundings? These Protective runes? It fits a demon? They protect me. Yep. Here, evil cannot touch me. How do you know? He told me himself. He paid me a visit once. I was blind already, but saw him clearly. Smiled. Said he was honoured I'd taken such an interest in him. He wished to thank me, and explained he'd taken a similar interest in me. He drew the circle and said I'd be safe within it. His way of repaying me, he said. Ever tried to leave it? If you'd heard how he said it, you'd be as certain as I am what leaving. Seems fair. So, what? Well, you know Do anything else about the man? Gauntor Odim is no man. He is evil. Evil which assumes various forms. Forget about him or die. You're alive. Alive? Yet I live in constant fear, born of what I've learned about him. Okay. So, Odim okay, made one of the facts. That's a stupid question, but yeah. Brilliant deduction. Yeah. Can you guess why? No, actually. You must know that he came from a wealthy, influential line. He must have, if the family of his betrothed accepted him. Yet did you know his fortune soured? He himself became an outcast. Oh, yeah, I remember. Iris's family, a powerful house, could not accept this. Yeah. Would not marry their daughter to a nobody. All geared wished to elope. The further away, the better. Yet Iris refused to cut her family ties. Quite the predicament. Indeed. Their luck turned yet darker when a wandering witch mentioned a solution. A man who would grant any wish. His name? Master Mirror. Master Mirror. The rest follows naturally. All geared and all dim. A meeting at a crossroads. A wish. A pact signed in blood. And a price to be Olgird was to sacrifice one he loved. Odim delights in difficult choices. He knew Olgird loved two in this world, 
His patrol? Oh. All gave chose. And soon thereafter married his beloved Iris. His fortune restored. Vladimir, did Olgird kill him? So did Olgird kill his own brother? No, oh no. Deduce, Witcher. Oh, dim. Oh, okay, fair enough. Indirectly. Hmm? Olgird merely signed. He sighed that he wanted all. The next day, uh, his brother was Vladimir dead. dead. You know this from Olgird? Did you tell you all that? He had to. How else was I to diagnose his case? Yeah, it's fair. sound like an illness. It's worse. Kind of is. Many illnesses are treatable. The play with evil. Medicine. Pe evil is a, is a terrible disease. Oh. Okay, what to break his pact? Why? Why was all geared out to get rid of Odin? He'd gotten what he wanted. Had he? <laughs> his heart had turned cold as ice. His feelings for his wife, for whom he'd sacrificed his brother, had withered. He'd lost all he'd loved. Had he wanted any of this? No. A dim grants what you wish, not what you want. All who sign a pact learn the difference and die by it. He is definitely up oh, there. No way to get rid of him? Kill him, you mean? Kill evil? Yeah. <laughs> no. Yet the annals tell of a man who dissolved his pact by defeating Old Dim at his own game. Meaning. Odin wields contracts, word traps, duels of wits. Challenge him to such a duel. He'll agree. And can be beaten. But remember, there is only ever one stake. Sole thing he truly desires. Human souls. Well. How can I get rid of this mug? Odin left a mark on my face. Any way to get it off? Mark. No mention in the tones. Strange. Unless. Unless it will disappear once your pact is fulfilled. If I challenge him, end the pact that way, will it go away? That I do not know. The one man who succeeded for no mark. Huh, thanks for the help. Thanks. Helped me a lot. Good. Very good. Oh, to feel useful after so many years locked up, living in fear, why, it's pleasance itself. Oh, you're dead. Yep. I'm feeling that journal could be helpful. Hmm. No, that's not it. There we go. Terrified me, there's a bunch of shivers, 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 not pay, but it's a little bit. New circle nightmares prey on me more and more. Dripped of daughters, strays that ever had children. Yes, we can see. He died of a deep leak, is it right? Strange pot of bird fur, look for the love, all creatures once now exist. Inside me peace. To me, the game that joined daughters, good and clever girl, and then for women. Ouch. Well, fair enough. Whatever a man soweth, what's that? Oh, that's that one. Oh, wait a minute. Why am I going up here? I've got the key to his house now. Oh, 
interesting, though. I'll go see Shiny. Yeah, I guess I can't come back out that way. Gotro Dim is straight up a demon. Which is good to know. I wonder if we'll get to see what it really looks like. I guarantee it's going to be a choice between save all geared or just accept Gotro Dim's thing. Don't know which one I prefer, honestly. I need to find Shiny's house again. Long live Radovid. He's around here if memory serves. House. No. Oh. Oh wait. Get out of my way. Fuck. That definitely wasn't it. One sec, I'll get a map up. <laughs> I'm just gonna look it up. This is the Western Gate. It is that house. Thank you, Google. Johnny. Yes, Carol. Okay, for a game, Gwen. You know, I've been wanting to ask you something. You ask me now. Just curious. You ever play Gwent? Oh, Geralt. Geralt. <laughs> What else is there to do come evening when one's among soldiers? Come on, let's lay them out. Yay! Jesus Christ. Going to road dim. It's quite a tell. I'm actually not too surprised this place is quite a tell. Pet with fog. That's pretty useful, actually. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm cool with that hand. That's about as good as I can get. I might as well use my uh, ability as well.
then. She's pretty good. I really do need the last one of those. Hold give one ever it. I got you here, Shani. And since I'm a monster. Nasty. Let's play an Earth Elemental. Ooh, a medic card. This is back whole geared. Let's play Triss. Jeez, she's got some powerhouse cards in the end here. But so do I. Drog. Yep, I win. Let's boost it out. Max power. I just want to genuinely see. I'm so I'm gonna hit. Cause it's Imrith. There's the lesson. And there's me! I'm a Gwent card, guys! 78. <laughs> So good, I'd say you spend more time chatting up folk the games than you do on serious matters. <laughs> nah, got lucky, that's all. <laughs> Likely. But here. I dare say, a formidable card from an old friend. So you won't have to rely entirely on luck. Oh, good one, Everick! Okay, back in a moment. Apparently something's gone wrong with the stream again, so I will go check. It's been doing that a bit recently. Unfortunate. I don't know what's doing it. It's a bit of a weird chain. It's a bit of a weird error that keeps popping up on the stream computer that says things go wrong. I'll have to make sure at some point. But hey, a lovely wedding. Gotta say, wedding was a great idea. Rarely have a chance to rest, get away from it all. It did me good to do just that. Oh, I'm a medic. I tend to know what I'm doing when I prescribe something. <laughs> Hope Vladimir's antics weren't too annoying. Peculiar man. Ghost, true. But I found him likable. <laughs> Wager he was a real hoot when he was alive. <laughs> Said you needed to think things over. Have you? Yes. I decided <laughs> you're incredibly sweet, but. But we're better off keeping things as they were. Mm -hmm. You're always going places and. They're likely to ship me off soon. Uh, besides, we tried once, and you know how that worked out. You're right. But promise to share a bottle of wine with me from time to time? <laughs> of course. I tell you what, I'll keep one handy. a go. See you around, Shadi. You're awesome. Because he ends up with Triss, or... 
Yeah. He ends up with Tracy and a photo of neither of them, I believe, as the story goes, isn't it? Which are very, three very decent ones. Well, I'd say that yeah, I end up with either of them is pretty rough. But I'm going to probably play this through my own time just to see, get the, um... I believe there's an achievement for finishing the game with each of them, I think. Actually, is there? I think there is. I think there's like a few achievements to do at the end of the game. actual got game achievements or if it's probably easier. No game. Did he have no Oh, I guess there isn't. So yeah, I don't really need to. I guess. Neat. Cool. That's not too bad though. Well, there's, I know there's a bunch of achievements, because it says there's like 15 hidden achievements. But it's uh, 13, I think it was, that I haven't gotten already, so... Likely a few of those doing like specific things in the story, I'd imagine. Because they did finish the story, but... There's always more to do. This is that kind of game. Pick up board resident. Okay. So it's gonna be if it, if he doesn't let me get out of it, just easy. Then I'll fight going through him. But for an all-powerful demon, he's been all right so far. What do you need, refugee? You going north, master? Why do you ask? Uh, I thought you could see if anything's happened to our men. Been gone a while. What do you need? Just to pay mean? the fucking hobos. The merchant caravan came through not long past. Hired some of our boys to guide him to the bridge. They were due back yesterday. Fine. Keep my eyes open. My brother Tomil led him. Talk to him when you find him. Clever man. Not like the rest of them, eh? Okay. Phantom of the Trade Route. Let's do that quest first, why not? I mean, it looks like a Witcher contract, I imagine. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I imagined it was pretty close. I must have just missed it. I think I ran past it. <laughs> Earlier, I knew it'd be some wonder what happened. Someone was running fast, panicked, prints are deep, and suddenly, somebody was bound. Rope was cut quickly with a dull blade. Someone walked through the spilled wine. Yeah, oh, god damn it.
those big knickers. Just casually kill it. I thought it didn't look quite right for a human. I don't see anything. Oh, hello. Claw marks. A flyer. Swooped down. Judging by the claw marks, gotta be a wyvern or a forked tail. Shattered the wine barrel. It seems the people managed to escape. Get Wanny. Smell will linger for hours. Okay. So it's just a wyvern. Or a forked tail. Just something similar. Eh, not too big a threat. I've killed plenty. Oh, but this is where I get wyvern head, actually. Because I did notice I haven't gotten one. I don't believe I've gotten a quest one of those. So this is actually a... I can get a trophy from one. Which is pretty badass, all things considered. Tracks lead to the cave. Oh, hello. Caught one just before you reached the cave. Ouch. Nasty little cave here. Hey, Oi, you Creve. Your eyes. But shine so in the dark. Thought at first it was a lizard coming. Thing that attacked. How big was it? Well, too big to squeeze in here. It were huge. And those teeth. Ugh, we barely escaped. Wonder if it killed the traders. Or some sure of it coming. Important thing now is to get out of here. Will ye help, Master Witcher? Which one of you, Stommel? Which one of you is Tamil? That one over there. Beast got it. But how do you know? His brother asked me to come and find you. What happened? Tell me. Tell me what happened. Some traders hired us to protect him along the high road, they said. For we knew it, they'd bound us like calves. Why? They were kind enough to explain a real precise that we were necessary sacrifice for progress and trade. So they left us, tied to the wagon as beast bait. Weren't long before a huge lizard appeared, as if its master had been Okay. Asleep. Monsters must have learned by now that army supplies travel down this road. Oi. Clever one, the lizard. Cut us off straight away. Left us to crawl in here. Poor Tom Eel didn't make it. I'll tend to the monster. Need to tend to the monster. Doubt I'll have to look far. Wyverns like to herd their prey towards their nests. We'll wait here. Wouldn't want to get in your way. Smart man! Wyvern. Lucky me. Royal Wyvern. Ooh. I'll take a look at him. Draconids, Royal Wyvern. Birds in the Birds of Royal Wyvern villain. The danger exposes of the human eyes are flying high, pick up prey from before. Stay with local roadside with familiar transports. From Goose Fat. It's fancy that resembles a dragon more than other lesser members of his own kind. No, this much stronger was it than non Wyvern. One blow of it could kill and avoid its charge at all costs. Why is it supposed to the ground with its crossbow and what? Okay. Because that's a big cave mouth, so this will be a real big fucker. Ah, yeah, it's saying out of here, so it is out. This is going to be a real big bastard. I'm imagining griffin sized, maybe a bit bigger. It's still pretty low level for me, so. Shouldn't feel too bad, but. Ooh, you're a pretty big bell, aren't you? Oh, there's a couple of you. Dragon is nest.
These are just the babies, I'm assuming. Well, that just happened. Wasn't them that attacked those people. Gotta be a royal wyvern hiding around here somewhere. More will spawn. Need to destroy the nests. Let's take a look at this big fucker then. Come here, biggin. Yeah, knew that would happen. So you're a pretty big fucker. Griffin size, that was right. Still not that bad though, low level. Feasted plenty, I reckon. Attacking those traveling the road. What do they call ye, master? Geralt of Rivia. Geralt of Rivia. It'll be a tale to tell the young'uns. I'm fine with it. That's a pretty badass thing. And here's the loot, I'm assuming. Yeah, knew we'd get a Wyvern trophy. Now let's see if this one's more worthy, because if this one beats out the Lechen, I'm more, I'm actually okay with it, if its ability is the same. Because I love the Lechen, but... That's pretty cool. It's a dragon head, straight up. Okay, I got a sword, right? Is that good? Nope. Uh, yeah, what does it currently do? Bonus experience from monsters, so it's the same bonus as the Lechen. Yeah, why not? Let's have a dragon head. Sorry, legend heads, you get uh, you got replaced, but it's a worthy replacement. You're still my favourite monsters in this game, like the legend, but there's not enough of you. Hey, uh. Slow now, whoa. Faster. I've forgotten how to ride a horse. That's it, Roach. There we go. Okay, Roach is just dead. <laughs> Am I, am I riding it wrong? No, I'm not. It's just a little buggy. The game has a couple of bugs in it. I will, I will definitely say that. I can't 100% defend it, but it's a damn good game. It more than makes up for the bugs. Because the bugs tend to be like real minor things. Greetings. Find your friends. I found your friends. I have spoken to him. They're too damn bad Tom Hill didn't make it. Here, take this. Thanks. It's appreciated. Farewell. Roach, get back here. Come on now. Oh, it, was, it wasn't much of a chat. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> I tried to play the nice guy, which uh, basically I don't need money. I really don't. 
I mean, technically, if I wanted to go really hard on the enchant that enchanting engraving thing, I could, but I don't really care that much. I'm doing fine. It's unnecessary. Take it easy. Oh, so this is the temple. It's really hard to see in here. Some time later. Hey, all good. Strange choice of locale. Guessing there's a reason for it. Not my choice. Wasn't me who chose it. I assumed so. Yeah, be honest to him. But since we're here, I believe you have something for me. Fulfilled your third wish. What is this? A canvas. And on it, your house, your wife, and the rose you gave her that day. This is not what I asked for. Phrased your wish wrong. Not the first time. And it's been my downfall. So beautiful. She looks alive. She is, in a way. Iris painted this, then entered it. What? How? No idea. She wanted your pack to end you to be yourself again. I think she missed you. The real yeah, you. I think that's right. She wanted the pact to expire so you could be yourself again, how you were before, no matter the price. I'd say that's about right. Iris, what a mess we've made of it all. If I'd only known then how it would end. What's happening? I feel as though. as though. a hot iron's pierced my chest. Look at me. Sorry to have kept you waiting. Fucking that's an entrance. So glad to see everyone's great. How do you feel, Von Everick? A little less trouble? Lighter on the heart? Or dim? What do you want? What do you mean, what? Your soul. You forget. The pack states you can take it only once you fulfill three wishes and... And we stand together on the moon. Well, what do you know? Yep. Had a pact. The moon is there. There! Not here. I gave you what you wished for. Here, on the moon, our contract yep. you fulfilled. Awesome. Look at me. I never cheat. He doesn't. Elbow geared. 
wait. Do not interfere, Witcher. Remember what I did to the last fool who interrupted me. You grant wishes, right? Grant mine and release him. He must repay his debt. Let him go, and I'll take it on. We'll call it mine. You wish to give your soul for his? No, but we can play for them. I lose, you take mine and all gears. But if I win, you release us both. What do you propose we play? Gwent? Don't know. Maybe we can bet on a challenge. You know I'm good at accomplishing the impossible. Seen me do it. Hmm. Very well. But we shall do this my way. Okay, what are we doing? I think this is a better ending, is the main reason. What's happening? You wish to play, so let us play. I shall tell you a riddle. Solve it, and both you and all geared will be free. And if I don't? <laughs> then we'll all three go for a wild ride. It's what you proposed, is it not? Okay. The riddle. Let me hear it. To all things and men I appertain, and yet by some am shunned in disdain. Fondle me and ogle me till you're insane, but no blow can harm me, cause me pain. Children delight in me, elders take fright, Fair maids rejoice and spin. Cry and I weep. Yawn and I sleep. Smile and I shall grin. What was that supposed to be? You tell me. What am I? Repeat the riddle. Didn't quite catch the riddle. I'm gonna Google this. I'm totally cheating, but so what if this is cheating? I'm not good at riddles. Okay, so apparently this isn't a riddle. Okay. Mind repeating it? To all things and men I appertain. And yet by some am shunned and disdain. Fondle and ogle me till you're insane. But no blow can harm me, cause me pain. Children delight in me, elders take fright. Fair maids rejoice and spin. Cry 
and I will it's annoying that the actual things didn't tell me. It just says, oh, you will find the solution smile, here. And I too shall grin. I actually want to... I want to figure this out, because it doesn't tell me anywhere In what the answer actually riddle. is. Mind it just says that I have to do to a run. all things and men and I appertain, and yet I some shun and disdain. disdain. Fondle and ogle me till you're insane, but no blow can harm me, cause me pain. Children delight in me, elders take fright. Fair maids rejoice and spin. Cry and I weep. Yawn and I sleep. Smile and I and too, I too shall, shall grin. grin. Now the thing is... The obvious answer is a mirror. Apart from one thing. Because, I mean, he's the mirror man, so it kind of makes sense. But... No blow can harm me. You can smash a mirror. So it's not a mirror. Fair maids rejoice and spin. The old don't like it. Children like it. Some cause pain. I got it. That's, an, that's a good one. I like that. That, I believe, not certain, but I believe that it's a reflection. If reflection is on this list, I've got it. Let's You're do this. Going down. We shall see, my friend. You must find me before the sand in the hourglass runs out. Ready? Yeah, it says Let's I have to begin. run. What is this place? <laughs> you like it? Plenty more where it came from. Just remember, you must find me before time runs out. Elkes. Uh, that stench. Monsters weren't part of the deal. My world, my world. Cry and I weep, yawn and I sleep, smile and I too shall grin. It's all I do. Maybe an echo? Echo. No. No dice. You can't possibly ogle an Yeah, all right. It's going to be a bunch of false answers. I thought I'd fucked up then. Children delight in me. Elders take fright. Fair maids rejoice and spin. Cry and I weep. Yawn and I sleep. Smile and I too shall grin. Damn it. What are you? Who the hell is that? This is a horrifying Help! track. Geralt, save me! Who's asking? Is that Shani? Don't leave me here! Help me! Shani, hang on, I'm coming. What the hell is she doing here? Damn it. <laughs> I can't believe you fell for that. You're a dick. I don't know this fucking demon brick. That's 
the sword. What is it about swords that turns men into utter fools when they see one for the taking? Through howling... Force of habit. Jeez, I'm not high enough level for it, but it's fucking good. Winds pouring rain with their life hanging by a thread. Which reminds me, time is running out. Halfway. No. Oh, awful. You're doing terribly. Remember, you can always give up. As I see it, you will never find me. No. Mirror. So this is where you're hiding. How <laughs> come now? You didn't expect it to be that easy, did you? No, it's not a mirror. Where's the water? It's gonna be water or something, right? One second, I fucking suck. Where's the water? The wall behind. Boom. He's going. Hello, demon. Some time later. So, any better? 
Yeah, thanks. Hey, Wine's scar's gone. Me a bit. This plonk could revive a corpse. An exquisitely rank vintage. <laughs> you know what, though? It's good at last to taste something real. So, have at it. Tell me what the blaze has just happened. Your brand's gone. Guessing that's a good sign. Tell me what it's like to have a heart of stone. You tell me what it's like to have a heart of stone. <sighs> it's wonderful at the start. You feel no fear, no angst. But also no concern, no care for anyone, not even those you loved. And gradually, you lose them. Well, you know how it ended. Yeah. What about your senses? Taste, smell? All there. At first, I savoured the world like never before. It was stronger, more clear. How's that possible? I did not wish for a heart of stone. That was a mere side effect. I wished to win back Iris's hand and have my fortune restored. And then to live like there was no tomorrow. And thus I lived until... until I ceased to feel anything at all. Yeah. What a joy to be done with it. Because... I am done, right? Will you tell me what happened? Yeah, sure. Mirror drive me into a game. Oh, Dim decided to have some fun at my expense. Devised a game I was supposed to lose. Seems he'd forgotten the training you put me through in doing the undoable. So only to protect myself. In doing so, I put you in harm's way. Forgive me. Mm. It's fine. Well. Don't have to worry about him anymore. You're safe and free. I think I pissed I him thank off. You. Though I've no notion what to do with this freedom now. Mira took everything. Everything I loved. All I held dear. Go to your house and walk into that painting. Not true. Got your heart back. A bitter victory. Now at last I sense how much I've lost. Yes, you have. I have a heart again. Yet all it feels is grief, sadness, and defeat. My life is a ruin. True. I don't envy you. Mm, can't say I envy you. As the saying goes, Careful what you wish for. Oh, I shall be. Believe me. Actually, I have a better idea. I'll never wish for anything again. It's a good bet. It's time I took fate into my own hands. Live life anew. And truly, this time. Sounds like a plan. I'll never forget what you did for me, Witcher. I have something for you. Ooh. Can't accept this. You can. And must. This saber's been in my family for generations. Even when I'd lost all else, it remained at my side. Means a great deal to me. All the more reason why I can't take it. Do me the honor. This'll mark the start of my new life. And such a weapon could be right useful to you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Fuck yeah. Ow. Sorry. Iris. You needn't be. He's just happy. I thank you again, Geralt. And good luck on the path. Good luck to you too. Off you go. Be a decent person, because your freaking wife adored you before you turned into a monster. So, she had to have something to reason for it. Heart of Stone! Done. That was good. Yeah, that was 
pretty damn good, if I do say so myself. Gonna make it, but it was a damn good little uh, expansion there. Going through a dim master mirror. Ah, uh, achievement. Can I equip the sword? Yes, I can. And it is fucking good. Weapon ch changes with energy and combo. His color changes to red. Strong attack releases energy. X power strike right costs part of your attacker's vitality. Ooh. Seems very fitting for a sword like this, to be honest. Chance to cause bleed. Uh, it's, it's already causes bleeding, so I don't need that. Yeah, I'm piercing. Chance to freeze. And a chance to stagger, why not? And then I have this at next level? Yeah, next level. So basically, I can... So when it glows red, I can do a big, like, shockwave, blasty attack. Or at least a shit ton more damage on an attack. Which is pretty badass, all things considered. So it gives me a, a bit more of a reason to use the heavy attack. Nope, wrong button. So meet the two meet the knights from Toussaint in a hallway. Entrance. Come on, Rich. Let's begin the next one, which I've heard is the best one of the best game expansions of all time. Also, now the title doesn't really make sense for the stream. hidden treasure. I was promised treasure game. Get, keep treasure all I like to see. Oh, yeah. There it goes. Roach! Move it. Back here. So we've got two really powerful swords. This is definitely upgrades. Warders Bridge. Don't be Can you imagine this guy riding towards you? Sword out. That'd be horrifying. A big freaking war horse. Like a uh, roach.
Those are nice horses. Proper armor charges. No need for your help. Have no fear, good man. Our labors shall be done quickly. The prowlers to be banished for good. Milton, look. Milton. Get out. In the flesh. Hail, Witcher. Let us go inside and greet you as befits an old. I don't know who this guy is, but you, I'm sure. Not. Fear not. We shall put an end to the rule of outlaws soon. I guess we know him then. But you was too something in one of the previous games, I'm assuming, sir. So. He did in proper full play. Which I don't think I'm seeing. on a notice board. You see, Palmerin? I told you. The Griffin at White Orchard. I knew that were we only to follow the tracks of its slayer, we would in the end find Geralt. Yeah, Milton sure. de Payrak Perrin and Palmerin de Lanfor. Good to see you both. In years. In a short, we share your joy. You must forgive hey. us our uh, surroundings. When we pledge to place oh, the village in our protection, the village elder gave us this hut as our lodgings. He swore it is the best hut in the village. Get involved in some squabble? We discovered that in retreating, the Redanian garrison that left this land's tillers at the mercy of numerous plagues. A tyranny of bandits, the most onerous among them. His plunderers shall soon descend on this village to collect tribute. Milton and I will dissuade them. We are both sworn to fight injustice and oppression wherever they rear. Paladins! The matter does not concern you, of course, but do us the kindness of waiting. Once we have dealt with these marauders, we have a matter we must present to you. And up with you bandits! So... Plan to go out and meet the bandits when they arrive? Fight them? Parmelon wishes first to appeal to their sense of decency. <laughs> but I expect they will be deaf to this. Yeah, completely. We must afford them a chance to stand down. Many a hardened outlaw has left the path of wrongdoing upon hearing words of admonition. Doesn't happen in these lands. Ever. Don't <laughs> heed my reprimand. We at least will know we have done all within our means to affair. <laughs> I like this guy! Fine. Naturally, I'll help when Pomeran's rhetoric falls on deaf ears. Excellent. Then we've but to wait for the rogues to arrive. <laughs> I like these guys. It's like, oh, just tell them all. It's like Reinhardt. They are coming. Hear that? Your bandits have arrived. Let us go out to greet. Is he one-handing a Zweihander? <laughs> Kitty! Run, kitty! <laughs> right then. Cracks the clock. Contemptible cars. To be honest, I wouldn't want to fight two armored knights. <laughs> They mean us. I, Palmer and Delonfall, call upon you to repent. Search your hearts. Do you not see that they are blackened? <laughs> Regular punch and duty here. To prey upon commoners is no honor. To loot their meager stores <laughs> the path of shame, and we will spare you. <laughs> Roy could jest that. Had us a laugh. Now, fuck off before we lose our patience and you lose something else. Nay, hey, wait, Zorg. These lads are a lark. Mayhaps they know some tricks. Oi, players! Can you toss balls all loopity like? Or do that thing where one spits fire while the other farts? <laughs> Take my advice. Listen to him. Noble Palmerin's giving you a chance. Now I'm gonna give you some advice. Do what he says. Or what? Or you'll find yourself fighting knights errant in the pay of the Duchess of Toussaint. And they eat scum like you with their morning porridge. Well, it 
There's three of them. Two turtled up in armor. We'll come back later. Some wench sent them. Folk who say we's a feared of wenches and jesters. Ooh, insulted the Duchess. Not good. Indeed, we can. <laughs> He's like, oh, you just insulted the Duchess with these songs. I swear upon the heron, you will pay with your own blood. By the crane, villains, ready your arms. Shielded bastards. And a shield broke. Oh, I can do that now with this thing. Sweet. There you go. Zorg. All right, you little fuckers. Balls, random dude. Why do they not emerge? It is over. We have banished the scoundrels, lifted oppression's yoke from their lives. Warned you it'd be like this. Fear you as much as they did the bandits now. Sorry, no fanfares and flowers. You're not in Toussaint. Ugh, it is true what folk claim. In the north, no noble deed goes unthwarted. It is time to go home. And we shall, my friend. Come, Geralt. It's time we delivered our message. <laughs> it's like, oh, we outnumber them four to one. This will be fine, right? I'm so happy with this sword, by the way. I can shield break. Up. What brings you such a long way? We are to deliver Her Grace the Duchess's message in full, with all due ceremony. For tradition it is sacred in Toussaint. All right, fine. Most honorable Geralt, slayer of monsters and all Ifols nefarious, which prey on the defenseless of this world. For us, never have you been known to deny help to the innocent, nor leave widows and orphans to fates undeserved. Answer you now our present summons. Free us from the beast which floods our streets with blood, and sows panic in the hearts of rich and poor alike. What Come hell? to our aid, Witcher. Thus humbly beseeches you the star Cross city's most gracious protectress, her illustrious highness, Duchess Anna Henrietta. Okay. Shall you answer her call? Yes. Anna Henrietta say all that? Anna Henrietta really say all that? Word for word? Well, in point of fact, she said, bring me the Witcher and dare not spare your horses. Only make certain this time he comes alone. The Ducal Chamberlain added the rest. You know how it is. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I remember. I might add, be it unofficially, that a hefty reward awaits. Yet the specifics you will need to verify with her illustrious highness. Oh, sure. This beast, tell more. Might be the most fervent request that I take a contract ever. And the most polite. And now we've got all that behind us. I want to hear more about this beast. Some kind of monster? Just guessing. 
Most assuredly, though no one has caught a good look at it as yet, our only sure witnesses, bodies massacred in a brutal so sneak. manner. Whatever it look, is. some sketches drafted from descriptions given by those who claim they glimpsed the beast, each quite different. To my mind, these witnesses lie. Yeah. How many victims so far? Two. When her grace learnt of the second, she discharged us immediately. The fucking slender man? Promising grants of land and fortunes in gold, should you answer her summons. An ill wind blows, Geralt. The beast cannot be tracked. Folks say it wields black magic. Also, both victims were nobly born, and the start of a tourney draws near. Beast wields black magic. Beast wields black magic? What makes you say so? The first victim vanished between bites at a feast. The feast goers not noticed this. They saw but an open window, then heard desperate cries from the street below where a corpse had just been found. The second killing similar. A knight in a locked room. Serpents all about the house. Guards all around the estate. Yet the beast somehow got him out, dragged him to the town square, and killed him there. No one saw, no hurt, a thing. We have no fear of creatures against which sword and shield protect. But on yeah. this beast, nothing is known, save that it cannot be traced, kills effortlessly, and with no rhyme or reason we can discern. Someone tried trapping it? Anyone tried to hunt it? Knight's Errand, for example? Ha! Many have tried. Baiting, waiting in ambush, but to know if so it's intelligent. the beast is clever. Yeah. It evades all traps and attacks of a sudden. It is like a ghost. An experienced tracker. This is what we need. With knowledge of monsters. In short, we need you. Is it Tony? Mentioned a Tony. Why doesn't the Duchess just call it off? Simply, it is too late. The guests have arrived. The best knights of all lands. Relatives of the Emperor. Beast could be a threat to others, not just to her grace's mm. subjects. Got it. Before an aristocrat dies, at best it's a scandal. At worst, a diplomatic incident. I'll take this contract. Uh, I sometimes think back to all the contracts I've ever taken from sovereigns. Can't name hardly any where I came out ahead. You cannot be thinking to refuse. <sighs> no. Just struck by a thought. How the Duchess can sometimes be... Mm. Demanding. So you accept the contract? Excellent! Naturally! You must set off at once. We long wanted this land searching for you, yet time is of the essence. Ready to go, as soon as you're packed. Ha! Ah, then post haste to Tucson. To Tucson! <laughs> I'm gonna like Tucson. A silver horse, a golden horse, and then Roach. <laughs> Bye, North. Okay, centuries ago, first, always go mobs cast the dangers. Can you know which schools train new witches? No, we taught one. We taught Siri. She's a witcher now. Oh yeah, spoilers for a previous stream. <laughs> we do one of my could play powerful. Yeah, I doubt anything is that powerful at this point. The enemies I was fighting just then were 36, so I imagine that the high end is going to be about 40. I'm 38 now, so I'm actually within fighting range of those. Maybe we should commit as well, better than common as well. Yeah, so I was right. It is like just the better defenses of the wolf armor. Both for crossbow, take a fashion, or table for a quick attack, or a body for precision. Let's take a look at the song. Imagine it's yeah, south of France, Italy, by the sounds of it. I like the theme. Toussaint, the land of love and wine. Exactly how I remembered it. Yep, this is south of France or Italy. You would find Beauclair has changed some these past years. Walk about when you have the chance. 
You will see for yourself. To me, place always seems straight out of a fairy tale. Knights errant, elven palaces. You insinuate that we are somehow odd? I shall prove you wrong. This I pledge on the heron. <laughs> That's Cyclops. You don't see that every day. There's some kind of giant. Let's do this, boy! Oh, that horse is dead. Cyclops. How the hell can it see? Come on, you big bastard. Okay, Musketeer. So let's just repair my sword while I'm at it. And the giant's down with a something in its back. Big beast, tackling it single-handed, none too wise. Spear Neither is love born of wisdom, creature. So, Guillaume, out with it. Which fair damsel inspired you to bow to <laughs> that fate? The most beautiful among them. If he wishes to guard her name a secret, he need not reveal it. You I do not know, sir, nor seem you a knight, yet still I am profoundly grateful, nay, indebted to you for your succor. This trophy, sir, is yours. How did giant wind up here? A giant this close to human settlements? Strange. Well, that was no ordinary giant. His name was Goliath. Rumored to have been a knight once, but one who broke his vows. For this, the Lady of the Lake transformed him into a wild giant and banished him into the Gorgon Hills. So he came back down? Why? Several times each year, hunger chased him into the lowlands. Goliath had killed and devoured many shepherds. Guillaume's hunt served a noble cause. At any rate, it's a tale for more agreeable environs. Glad to take the trophy, you did well, guys. I'll take the trophy, why not? Could find someone who'll pay to buy it. Put up a good fight against the giant. Got experience battling monsters? None. In Tucson, we mostly chase bandits. But I vowed I'd bring my heart's champion the head of a monstrosity, as the famed Gottfried, known as the Giant Killer, did. You don't mean to hunt the beast, I hope. The matter's best left to Geralt. Another challenge awaits me. Yet if Geralt is to hunt the beast, he ought to know. It struck again. Yeah? The river surrendered a corpse. It washed up in the meander by the cockatrice. Damien de la Tour's guardsmen are there already, securing the area. Securing the area? Better go there now before they trample any tracks, manhandle any evidence. Set forth then. I shall ride for the city to inform her gracious magnificence that Geralt has arrived. We'll meet later. Near Guillaume's tent at the Tourney grounds. I shall take you then to see her grace. Okay.